Hey guys, welcome back to Marketing Fundas Global. This is the 39th video in this Google Ads course. And in this video, we are going to tell you about how to create tracking template for Google Ads. Well guys, URL tracking template is one of the instrument that helps you to track your Google campaigns data. Well guys, tracking your campaigns and tracking your data is one of the important part in order to become a Google Ads expert. And this is one of those videos that will help you to be more precise in order to track your Google Ads data. So let's get into the video without any further ado. So guys, we have logged in into our Google Ads account. And now before going forward, I wanna tell you that why it is important and why it is helpful. Well guys, if you want to track any specific data of your Google Ads campaign, whether you want to track device, keywords, campaign, or any other, you can do with this tool. So let's learn how this tool works step by step. And we also provide you a pretty handy and helpful Google support page, which will help you to find values that can be added in your URL in order to track your uh, data. So let's get into it. So guys, first of all, you have to log in with your Google Ads account and side by side, you have to log in the page or the website you want to track. So I have logged in here. I mean, I've entered the URL here. This is the URL. Okay which uh, this is the website or you can say the landing page which I want to track okay and this is the page this page is, says set up tracking with value track parameters so here you will be able to see value track parameters which will help you to track your landing page or website according to the parameters which we have added here like campaign ID ad group ID extension ID feed uh, item ID target ID so these are the parameters which you can track or you can say these are the value tracks which you can track according to your preferences okay you can track devices, network, match type, device model. So that is totally up to you which uh, which type of targeting or which type of tracking you want. Okay. So I hope you are getting the point that these are the parameters uh, you can add in your URL in order to track the data precisely and according to your preference or according to your idea. Okay. Let me show you one example. Let let me go back to my Google Ad account. Now go to settings, then account settings. And here is the tracking option as you can see. Right now it is on no set. Okay. So let me add first a tracking template. And this is the example that you can use to create a tracking template. Okay. So let me tell you one thing that the first part of your tracking template is will be your website or your landing page. Okay. And the end part after the slash. Okay. You have to create this by on yours. Okay. So let me show you an example. So this is the tracking template. This is the URL which I have created. And this URL will help me to track devices. Okay. And before this, I have to add slash. And here before this URL, I have to add my landing page or my website's URL. Okay. So let me copy this and then paste here. So this is the final URL or you can say tracking template. Okay. And here I have to leave it as it is for now okay so we have to click on test button so press this and once you click on press button you will be able to see the status right now it is showing landing page not found but yeah uh, this is to just just to show you and also you can see here is the tracking is properly successful tracking call successful tracking call successful tracking call successful so that's how the thing works okay the main of aim of this url is to track your website's data track your landing pages data and that's happening properly but you might be confused or you have a question that how i created that url let me close this one and here is the url okay this is the tracking template this is the proper url which helped me to track everything or uh, the device data only so this is the specifically data which I want to track. And the question is how I created this one. Okay. So this is the URL. This is my website's URL. And after the slash, this is the question mark, which says that I want to track something. Then URL then is equals to curly bracket LP URL, which means landing page URL, then curly bracket close and then end. And after that end option, you have to add which type of tracking you want. You can go to that page that setup tracking value track setup tracking with value track parameters. So here you will be able to see all the parameters which you can add in that particular URL. Here's the campaign ID, ad group ID, feed item ID. Let's say you want to track campaign ID. Okay, so just copy this one, copy, go to your uh, Google ad account and change this one into paste campaign ID. And here as well, you have to write the campaign ID. So that's how you create uh, the URL, which will help you to track each and everything. 
okay so i hope you understand each and everything which i have told you so far so that's how you create your url which will help you to track and if you go to this page this uh, setup tracking with value track parameters you will be able to see all the options all that uh, parameters which will help you to track okay if you scroll a little bit down here is the advanced parameters and here are the parameters uh, that you have to add in your url okay i'll be adding this google support page url in my videos description you can go through this page and it will help you to, to find parameters in future as well so you can go through this page thoroughly and you can create your own url which will help you to track your campaigns data so i hope you understand the video i hope you like the video if you do so please hit that subscribe and like button if you still have any question or query please comment down below and i'll try to answer that question we'll meet you in the next video till then bye bye